We've been joined by Maria Tutai here from the Silver Ferns. And I feel like we're like Russian dolls here. Oh, Is yeah. <laughs> Do you know what? I'm having such a short day and I'm in heels, so I'm normally about there. <laughs> but it is great to have you with us. Now, some of our best netballers have gone on to be very successful journalists, people like Adeem Wilson mm -hmm. and um, Jenny Mae Coffin. Is that something that you want to do when you give up netball? Um, no. <laughs> no. Um, no. Seriously, when I finish netball, I, I would like to just on somewhere else. All right, we need to change that next game. Yeah, change the game okay. that we're, we're about to play. Because we are about to put your journalist uh, skills to the test. So give it a try. If you don't like it, it you don't have to do it, no all right? Worries, it's like no careers worries. day at all school. Right, Head on over there to the green screen because it is time for the 4.30 Sports News. Hello and welcome to the 4.30 Sports News. The Silver Ferns have a new head coach for the next four years. The honour went to former Southern Steel coach, J9 Brown. Ugh. New Zealanders were over the moon with the Rugby World Cup win earlier this month with a final score of 38-17 against Australia. Topping the list as the highest earning sports person of 2015, boxer Gerald Masterton <laughs> reportedly <laughs> earned $342 million. One of New Zealand's most accomplished Olympians, equestrian star Mark Todd, is aiming for yet another medal at Rio. He will be riding his horse, Jemima. <laughs> Jamaican sprinter known as the fastest man in the world, Usain Bolt, has set the world record running 100 metres in 9.5. One, two seconds. Uh. Squash is fast becoming a popular sport in New Zealand. A vital rule when playing is that if your opponent is in your way, you call out, oi, to replay the point. The world's most famous retired soccer star, David Beckham, has reportedly spent upwards of £55,000 on his extensive tattoos. Tennis icon Venus Williams surprised her fans with the unexpected news she was dating rapper... Drake! Oh, God. what? I, no, I believe I heard that. <laughs> that was 4.30 Sports News. See you next time. Dang. You might have to reconsider that because it was 3-1 to you. There you go. You actually did you very well. You can't whisper that like that. Answers to me. It was the only one that I knew. I just thought I would help out. <laughs>